I'm Paula Bradshaw and I'm running for Congress in the 12th Congressional District of Southern Illinois. I invite you to watch the debate in which I put up my pro concrete proposals up against the sound bites and empty rhetoric of my opponents. Electing the right person to Congress is especially important in 2016. We need someone who will stand against the presidential war making that has led to skyrocketing debt, domestic austerity, and has brought death and misery to millions of people in the Middle East, Africa, and elsewhere. If either Hillary Clinton or Donald Trump is elected president, we will need to have a Congress that's ready to assert itself against the proven warmongering of the one or the wild unpredictability of the other. I'm the only candidate in this race who has called for ending our nation's disastrous and illegal acts of war and illegal assassinations overseas, and also cutting military spending and reallocating funds to meet our needs here at home. I'm the only candidate who will make the fight against global climate change a top priority. My two opponents are peddling the delusion that our regional economy can be, still be based on the dying coal industry. I support the ca carbon fee and dividend system proposed by the Citizens Climate Lobby. I am an uncompromising defender of our air, water, and soil, which is the foundation of life on our planet. I'm the only candidate who supports a ban on fracking and other extreme forms of fossil, fossil fuel extraction, an end to subsidies for fossil fuels, and a Green New Deal to put millions of Americans to work at a living wage or better. Modernizing our infrastructure, imp improving energy efficiency, expanding renewable energy, and building sustainable transportation. And yes, the Green New Deal includes a plan to pay for it that would not involve tax increases on American workers. I support real monetary reform, having the federal government issue currency directly instead of borrowing money from a consortium of private banks that control our money supply. I will demand that our government stop domestic spying on American citizens without a warrant and other violations of the Fourth Amendment. I would re vote to repeal the Patriot Act, the Military Commissions Act, <clears throat> indefinite detention without habeas corpus, and other attacks on our civil liberties. I support criminal justice reform, demilitarizing the police and using our federal government to put an end to senseless poverty and institutional racism once and for all. The criminal justice reforms I support include repealing the prohibition of cannabis and hemp. If legalized, industrial hemp would provide a major boost to our economy in southern Illinois, providing a basis for a number of spin-off industries that would employ thousands of workers at a living wage. I support Jill Stein's plan to make higher education tuition-free and cancel ex existing student debt. And I fully support a completely public health care system to cover every American. I support fair trade, not free trade, like deals like the Trans-Pacific Partnership, which would subvert national sovereignty. I would vote to repeal NAFTA and other free trade deals that have harmed American workers and workers in other countries. When they take polls, they find that most Americans support measures like this. It is time to elect someone to Congress who will represent the people, not the interests of a small class of corporate and bank owners. If you agree, please vote for me on November 8th.